Hi there, and welcome to Nostalgia Hit. In today's video, we start a new series, where we revisit the cast of classic films from Hollywood's golden era. And what better a film to start with than the 1959 romantic crime comedy Some Like It Hot. Enjoy the video. George Raft played Spats Colombo. In 1959, Raft was 57 years old. He was born on September 26, 1901. He died from emphysema on November 24, 1980. He was 79 years of age. Raft's last acting role was in the 1980 crime comedy film The Man with Bogart's Face, where he played Petey Kane. Pat O'Brien played Detective Mulligan. In 1959, O'Brien was 59 years old. He was born on November 11, 1899. He died of a heart attack on October 15, 1983. He was 83 years of age. O'Brien's last acting role was in a 1982 episode of the TV series, Happy Days, called Grand Monmus Baum, where he played Uncle Joe. Joey Brown played Oscar Fielding III. In 1959, Brown was 67 years old. He was born on July 28, 1891. He died from complications from arteriosclerosis on July 6, 1973. He was 81 years of age. Brown's last acting role was in a 1964 episode of the drama TV series, The Christophers, called Basis of Law and Order. Nehemiah Persoff played Little Bonaparte. In 1959, Persoff was 39 years old. He was born on August 2, 1919. He died of heart failure on April 5, 2022. He was 102 years of age. Persoff's last acting role was in a 2003 episode of the TV miniseries, Angels in America, called Millennium Approaches, Bad News, where he played a rabbi. Joan Shawley played Sweet Sue. In 1959, Shawley was 33 years old. She was born on March 5, 1926. She died from breast cancer on March 22, 1987. She was 61 years of age. Shawley's last acting role was in a 1985 episode of the crime comedy TV series, Crazy Like a Fox, called Suitable for Framing, where she played a manager. Dave Barry played Mr. Beanstalk. In 1959, Barry was 40 years old. He was born on August 26, 1918. He died from cancer on August 16, 2001. He was 82 years of age. Barry's last acting role was in a 1979 episode of the crime drama TV series, Vegas, called Runaway, where he played a security guard. Harry Wilson played one of Spat's henchmen. In 1959, Wilson was 61 years old. He was born on November 22, 1897. He died on September 6, 1978. He was 80 years of age. The cause of death is undisclosed. Wilson's last acting role was in the 1965 drama film The Cincinnati Kid, where he had an uncredited role as a spectator at a cockfight. Beverly Wills played Dolores. In 1959, Wills was 25 years old. She was born on June 7, 1933. She died in a house fire on October 24, 1963. She was 30 years of age. Wills' last acting role was in a 1964 episode of the TV series Mr. Ed, called Ed the Shish Kebab, where she played Judy Price. The episode was posthumously released after her death. Barbara Drew played Nellie Weinmeyer. In 1959, Drew was 43 years old. She was born on February 11, 1916. 
She died on September 17, 2001. From complications from a stroke, she was 85 years of age. Drew's last acting role was in a 1965 episode of the TV series, Green Acres, called Don't Call Us, We'll Call You, where she played Miss Bromley, the secretary. Grace Lee Whitney played Rosella. In 1959, Whitney was 28 years old. She was born on April 1, 1930. She died of natural causes on May 1, 2015. She was 85 years of age. Whitney's last acting role was in the 2007 sci-fi adventure film Star Trek of Gods and Men where she played Janice Rand. Georgie Stone played Toothpick Charlie. In 1959, Stone was 55 years old. He was born on May 18, 1903. He died on May 26, 1967. After suffering a major stroke, he was 64 years of age. Stone's last acting role was in a 1963 episode of the TV series, Sunset Strip, called The Conclusion, where he played Mr. Devinger. Mike Mizerke played one of Spat's henchmen. In 1959, Mizerke was 51 years old. He was born on December 25, 1907. He died of heart failure on December 9, 1990. He was 82 years of age. Mizerke's last acting role was in the 1990 slapstick comedy film, Mob Boss, where he played Don Taglianetti. Edward G. Robinson Jr. played Johnny Paradise. In 1959, Robinson was 26 years old. He was born on March 19, 1933. He died of a heart attack on February 26, 1974. He was 40 years of age. Robinson's last acting role was in the 1971 TV sci-fi adventure movie, City Beneath the Sea, where he played Dr. Berkson. Billy Gray played Sig Polyakov. In 1959, Gray was 55 years old. He was born on March 17, 1904. He died on January 4, 1978. He was 73 years of age. The cause of death is undisclosed. Gray's last acting role was in a 1966 episode of the TV series, That Girl, Called Beware of Actors Bearing Gifts, where he played Stanley Zip. Tony Curtis played Joe. In 1959, Curtis was 33 years old. He was born on June 3, 1925. He died from a cardiac arrest on September 29, 2010. He was 85 years of age. Curtis's last acting role was in the 2008 war romance film, David and Fatima, where he played Mr. Schwartz. Jack Lemmon played Jerry. In 1959, Lemon was 34 years old. He was born on February 8, 1925. He died of bladder cancer on June 27, 2001. He was 76 years of age. Lemon's last acting role was in the 2000 fantasy drama film The Legend of Bagger Vance, where he has an uncredited role as the narrator, Old Hardy Greaves. Marilyn Monroe played Sugar Cane. In 1959, Monroe was 32 years old. She was born on June 1, 1926. She died from a barbiturate overdose on August 4, 1962. She was 36 years of age. Monroe's last acting role was in the 1962 film short, Something's Got to Give, where she played Ellen Arden. We hope you enjoyed our look back at some Like It Hot. If you have any suggestions for other classics you'd like covered from Hollywood's golden era, let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching Nostalgia Hit.
Please remember to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Why not watch another video listed on the screen now? Until next time.